Good morning, everybody. It's November 3rd, Election Day. We uh, had a little bit of a rough night last night. Oh, Mr. Miles didn't want to sleep. Um, so I got up early, per Maria's request. And now he's just resting comfortably in his little, his little seat there. Sleeping away. So I decided to whip up a egg casserole. Never done this before. And uh, so we'll see how it goes. Chase made egg casserole. It is now 10 o'clock. I slept until 9.30, thank the Lord. Baby is still asleep, so I'm gonna enjoy this while I can. Egg casserole. Mm. Pretty good. Very good. Yum. Mr. Miles was awake from four to seven every hour. But he's got a little cold, I think. Getting some sun today. He looks way less yellow. Just good. Oh, buddy. You're in the mud? Oh, yes. You were in the mud? So much for mud. Welcome home. Did you miss us? Yeah, yeah you oh, gotta yes. sniff around before you meet the child. Aw, <laughs> oh, buddy. Oh, Miles, your brother is here. Look. Look, who's this? Who's that? Don't. He's not going to be too thrilled. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Unfazed for now. <laughs> Unfazed. <laughs> Well, uneventful, bud. Don't kiss the face. You're gonna be licking his tears out. Be no, nice. No. no. Down. 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 Be nice. Be you nice. Hey, sit. No. He's like gonna be. Push down to sniff. I know. I'm worried he's gonna be everywhere. Who's this? Your brother? Don't you dare take a squat anywhere, dog. Be nice. That's a baby. Oh, I just can't wait to be king. <laughs> be this. No one said be there. No one said stop that. The turtle is covered in snow. It's blowing straight from the north. It's pretty cold out. There's probably an inch on the roads, but they came by with the snow plows already to sand. It's a little clear. The grass is just dusted, as you can tell. Hello. Someone's hungry. Hmm. <laughs> Is that the timer for your potatoes? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Cooking, cleaning, being productive. 
Picking out paint colors. Hmm. I like this booger green. <laughs> it's actually called exotic yellow. Psh, Dutch boy, come on. This one. French custard. Mm, like terracotta. Desert varnish. Who comes up with these paint names? Antiqued fuchsia. Hmm. These ones are fun. Teal sea glass. Carmella coral. Hmm. Sweet bee. Oh, this one's called sweet bee. Do we need that in Miles' room? It is November 17th. And we are waiting for the piano to be delivered from our old apartment, huh, buddy? Yes, we are. It'll be going here along this wall. It's a nice day out, but it's windy. The recycling people just came, which our bin was overflowing and falling all over. We need to go to Goodwill. What else? We need to go get pictures for your baby buck from Walmart. And stuff for Thanksgiving foods that we gotta make, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you sleeping? Are you gonna go to sleep? Oh, rock a bye, my baby boy. Rock a bye, my old. Don't be sad. Maybe. Happy Sunday morning. Things are going well. Um, we are four weeks old as of yesterday. And I just kind of wanted to walk through the house, show what's been done, and show off my nursing cart, and just vlog. <laughs> Pick up the camera and vlog. That's all I wanted to do today. <laughs> So I've been, I haven't used my electric pumps pump yet. I've only been using the Hakka's. So I have two, a large one. They both have suction on the bottom, super nice. And this smaller one, four ounce one, both have suction. So you can't spill them once they're suctioned to the counter. Um, I've yet to use a bottle. That will probably come next week sometime. And so I've been using other bags that I was gifted and given to for free, but I have the Kindy, or Kind Kindy, this brand. There it is. Kin I call it Kindy, because it's like Swedish or German or something. Um, I have three gallon or quart freezer bags full of milk, and totally, I have 37 ounces. This one has more in it. 37, 42, and 34. I just made that one this morning. So over 100 ounces. And I just freeze them flat, store them in there, and then put them in the freezer bags, which I'll probably move to the deep freezer after a bit. I have our pictures. Always enjoying the sunshine and warmth. Also, I forgot I never showed the piano after it got delivered. So this is our music corner. I'm in love. Need to get it tuned. That'll be part of one of my Christmas presents because it's kind of pricey. But... Nice day out. It's a little chilly, but what do you expect for end of November? Little man was doing tummy time, and now he's sleeping pretty good. And yes, I know they're not supposed to sleep on their stomach, but I'm literally sitting right next to him as he's asleep. Oh, we also realized he did have a birthmark. Um, <laughs> kind of.
kind of like a stork bite. You can kind of still see it. It's fading quickly, but he had that on his crown of his head, which he did have pretty significant bruising on his head and a cone head when he was born, just from the way he was laying in my birth canal. But yeah, there's the birth mark. That's the only one we've noticed so far. Oh, I fall more in love with him every day, even though he cries. <laughs> but he only cries when he wants his mom or needs food or is in pain. I'm checking out the hy -V. Um, This came in the mail. Food and entertaining catalog. Listening to music, which, oh my god, this is a new song by Sam Smith and Labyrinth. Now it's over, but that was great. We'll listen to Sam Smith today, his new album. Got my coffee. I've only had to rewarm it once, but I made myself a new cup. So that's awesome. My god, buddy, quit tooting over there. Okay, we'll see how much I get through of this before he might wake up. But, um, this is a nursing cart. It's three tier, one, two, and three. has wheels that also, they do lock, and then it has a handle to kind of pull around on top. So, this was an idea off an Instagrammer, Nurse Carrie Locher, Loker, I don't know how to say Locker, I don't know how to say her last name, but she's an RN, but also does a lot with breastfeeding and nursing and um, sleeping with babies and stuff like that. So, um, this was taken from her. The first rack I have lavender room spray. It's literally just water and lavender essential oil. Extra hair ties and Germex. Two, two Germex Purells on there. Um, I have extra burp cloths, a binky, his booties that he loves wearing that are so cute. They're little Velcro ones. Diapers and then face wipes for his tears and eyes and hands. Um, and then second shelf I have Kleenex box. And all this is literally I'm gonna grab you guys because he literally has his own little pharmacy here we have he's got a really bad diaper rash which I feel so bad for um, but cornstarch literally just started using that a couple days ago here's all the dang ointments that we have tried and the Bordeaux's baby powder coconut oil aquaphor baby and we've been using Calmoceptine, it was behind the counter. And then this is his pharmacy. <clears throat> Has gripe water, saline spray for his nose, a snot sucker, vitamin D supplement drops, um, gas drops in case he needs them, and probiotic, which we have put this on hold for now, but it was helping him poop. But now we don't want him to poop as much because his poor, his poor bottom is so raw. But, but, <laughs> anyway, this is like his little pharmacy and some gripe water if he's really fussy. Oh, and then I got cornstarch. And then the last shelf is pumps, which I got from a fellow old coworker and friend. Um, super grateful for that. They're just the Medela pump in style advance. Um, she got them through insurance, so she literally just gave me them. So I can have one for home and one for work once I go back to work if needed. Um, these booby tubes. <laughs> You can freeze them. There's like rice or something in them, but you can freeze them or heat them in the microwave. I have used them heated to help with um, engorgement a couple times. And then this is all literally just pump cords, supplies, extra bags, connectors, a car charger, and that stuff. Um, back to this middle shelf, I have nursing pads, which I haven't used very, I used a lot like in the first two weeks of life. I've kind of tapered off and haven't really used them only at night just in case because I don't want to wash sheets all the time and then Kleenex and a couple packs of wet ones so this cart is awesome because then I just take it wherever I need to go <laughs> his room our room at night I actually didn't even bring it in there last night but it just hangs out usually in the middle of the well I keep it right by right by us in our little spot but so that's that